Hi everybody, Fresh Bread. So I'm David here, and um, Fresh Bread is an in inspirational word, and a musical interlude or musical song or something the Lord is birthing um, for the time out of the message which we've shared. So it's real important because I, f I feel a psalmist ministry. This is the time for psalmist ministry. And so that's, that's, what I, that's what I am. That's what I do. That's what I teach. And that's how I want to bless you. Today is interesting because um, I feel God is saying that sometimes I move quickly. Um, there's sometimes, and we'll deal with that in a in an upcoming session, the time sometimes when God wants us to just wait, and there's sometimes when God is ready to move quickly. And I was reading the book of ne Nehemiah, and some things pop out there, um, and I'll just try to get the um, Hebrew uh, calendar months, um, so we'll 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 get that, so so we can talk about that too, because. Nehemiah chapter 1, um, where he first gives us an, an in introduction to what is happening. And I'll just find it right here. I have it. Um, says in the month, the word in the verse 1, Nehemiah 1, the words of Nehemiah, the son of Hakaliah. It came to pass in the month of Kislev, or in the 20th year. So, in the month of Kislev, that is uh, one, two, three, so seven, eight, nine, the ninth month, um, Kislev is when he tells us he, he was in the citadel and he got news that the wall of Jerusalem was broken down and burnt by fire and the gates were burned by fire and so it was in terrible state and he felt badly. So that was Kislev. And then he tells us in chapter two, it came to pass in the month of Nisan, so um, from the time he heard it in Kislev to Nisan is one, two, three, four, five months. It, it goes Kislev, Tevet, Shavat, Adar, then Nisan. So um, five months to intercede because he, he was uh, saying, verse five, I pray, Lord God of heaven, you keep uh, you great, oh, great and awesome God, you keep your covenant and mercy with those uh, who love you and observe your commandments. And then he's saying, please let your ear be attentive. And then he goes ahead to con confess, confess the sins of the children of Israel, which we have sinned against you. So he's, he's burdened. So God really uh, brings him this, this burden. He's living his life. He's doing well. He has a great job. And then gets this news and he's burdened. So God is taking these four, 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 month, four or five months to really, uh, uh, accentuate this burden in his life. And then Nisan now, the, the king calls him, and it came to pass in the month of Nisan that the king says, why, why are you sad? You know? And so the king says, let, let, let me know wh what you want. So he's given that time now to uh, tell the king what he wants. All right, and then, so N Nisan is like April, May, and then we hear then that the wall is finished. The, um, I'm, I'm just po pointing out the actual um, um, scriptures wh which actually give, give you the months, all right? So in chapter 6, verse 15, it says, so the wall was finished on the 25th day of Elul in 52 days. So Elul is about s September, and then for 52 days meant it means it was about two two months. So the month before that is Av. So Av and Elul was when the wall was actually being built. Nisan is one, two, three, four months before that. So he had four months from the time the king said, let me know what, what you want. And he prayed quickly and then God gave him ask for uh, timber from the pe people ab uh, by the, from the people who keep the timber and so on. And, and so he asked for um, letters to the governors so he could get the timber and so on. So all of the planning to get the timber down to the site and all of that kind of stuff, that took the four, four months. Nissan is when he asked for it. So he's on site and building in 52 days, two months, Av and Elul. Now, c considering that it was only, what, seven, eight months before that, the whole thing started. So God burdens him. And then Nissan, uh, the, the king asks him, what do you want? And then there's actual planning for three months 
for the actual getting the stock and supplies and the people who are actually going and then he he gets there and they build for two months and the project is done well the, the walls are built now we deal with the people issues and the priesthood and the Levitical um, people who had to be cleansed and marriages to be fixed up and different sorts of things that had to happen but the um, project that was on his heart that was burdening him was the gates were burned by fire and the walls were broken down so that was finished in 52 days let me tell you God can move quickly <laughs> if if you consider a project as large as building the walls around a city and he now has to go and activate people to, to build the section of the wall in front of them and get help and make sure everybody knows how to build it correctly then make sure that your section ties in with the next one because you can't have any weak uh, points in the wall and it all ties in and you go from this gate to this next gate and the gate is put in place and hung doors are hung and all 52 days so let me tell you God can move very quickly sometimes and some of you need to know that um, God can surprise you with how quickly he can move. <laughs> and I'm, I'm sure all of us have experienced at some point God moving very quickly. And um, not that he does that every time, but it's up to him because he knows what is best. He knows what your life can take and what you can't take. And he knows when you need to learn a bit of patience. And when I you know, want to rush. I'm a person who likes to get things done like yesterday, you know. And at times when, no, David, take it easy. We're going to go at my speed. And so it, it really hurts you to, you know, go that slowly, you know. But then there, there are times when God will move very swiftly. So um, take heart. When he says, let's do it now, then you do it now. And it can go very quickly even a big project i mean miracles will happen and god's favor will happen so some of you need to uh get get your shoes on and get ready because god's going to move very quickly and i just just want to encourage you with that as uh, as we end off 2022 um god's going to move some, some of you very quickly and um just just get just get ready for it um uh, you, you will probably sense it by the extent of the burden which he has given you and how urgent it is. And so, um, yeah, I, I just want to encourage you with that. All right, and a little song that came about out of that, I was feeling I'm in E minor, D and then B minor. God, come quickly, please answer the matter I see. Intently with all of my heart, God, answer my plea. Sometimes you move quickly, God. Let this be your time when you move. Please answer the cry of my heart. Hear me, I plead. Come, Lord, and answer your servant who calls on your name. Because you have given the vision, and you alone can complete. You have given the vision and you alone can complete God come quickly and answer the matter I see you have you have given the burden you have given the burden God you have given the vision and you alone can complete you alone can complete you alone can complete yes lord hear our cry oh god and move swiftly in jesus name